September 11, 2001. There was a plane crash at the World Trade Center, near my apartment. I quickly got up, grabbed my camera gear, film, and batteries, and ran out the door. For me, the one word that describes that day, and the 20 years since, is resilience. It describes the emergency personnel, New York City itself, and its residents, as well as my life and career. In fact, resilience defines all of my photography assignments, from 9-11, to the struggles throughout India, from the fallout in Chernobyl, to the lack of quality education in Central America and Southern Africa. These are some of the stories I want to share with you. I believe that in life, in every experience, you should take away as many lessons as you can and always try to leave a little of yourself behind. We grow while helping others grow. We survive by sharing our stories, our knowledge, and our memories. So I decided to search for assignments that could leverage my technical skills for a worthy cause. It would provide me complete access to resilient people working in difficult circumstances. I've come to appreciate how delicate it is that education should be considered a right, not a privilege, a profoundly human right, as much as freedom and health. It's especially important for marginalized people and those in rural communities. Education is optimism. If our children are smarter than us, maybe they'll help solve the problems we couldn't fix. Reflecting on the resilience of the world around me, I realize we have to take responsibility for our past to truly know where we are going. These challenges are not new, but by honestly understanding them, we will be better prepared to achieve the real change our generation is capable of.